Hi Capricorn, this is Shah and this is your reading from the 27th to the 2nd of August. And I'm taping this on the 22nd of July and we've just entered Leo yesterday. And so the energy has changed to action, creativity, um, logic and passion. Perhaps you might be more passionate about something in the coming weeks. Let's see what the cards are going to say. This week I'm using the Shadowland and I'm using the Enchanted Lenamon and Archangel Metatron and the cards Angel Reading Cards. Okay, let's get started. This is Monday, Wednesday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. The overall energy or the querent card, the querent being you. You start off with the Ace of Swords and that means victory. Okay, victory also brings acknowledgement. You are being recognized and acknowledged by your community, friends, family, your boss uh, in general. Okay, so remember this is a general reading, so if it's not res resonating with you, have a look at your moon sign or your rising sign. And you might even get recognition from a Gemini or Libra or an Aquarius, as this is the card of air. And those are the elements, the zodiac signs of air. You might start a new study. You might start a, a job in an institution or a municipality, as the air science also stands for wisdom, communication, um, honesty, clarity, and truth and judgment. Okay, judicial issues. So if you are having um, um, judicial issues, you will have victory. You will get what you deserve and so will the other. That is the overall energy for this week. On Monday we've got the Six of Cups. You might be reminiscing or memoring, uh, dreaming about the past or remembering things from the past. And by could be good memories more than negative memories as you were once a child and look the child it could be about the grown-ups that you had around you or grandma or other people that you celebrated with good memories you might be wishing that um, those times would come back they can, but they won't never be the same or with the same people perhaps, but you can always bring the nice memories back or the experience by do redoing them with others. Perhaps you might be inviting others up to have a, this beautiful picnic that you had years ago. But it could also be a reunion. There could be a reunion, somebody coming back from the past and bringing you a gift. That could be on Monday or during the whole week really, because time is man-made. Then we have on Wednesday the Knight of Swords, again the air signs. So air is quite prominent uh, this week for you and it could be the Gemini, it could be a Libra like I said or an Aquarium. News is coming to you. This could be cyber news, telephone, text message or an email. So news is on its way. It could be some, from somebody from the past. Whoopee! <laughs> if you've got good memories and somebody's come connecting with you from somebody from the past is connecting with you through email, perhaps they are letting you know they are coming your way or they will be around um, in your area because they might be going on holiday who knows there could be competition because you've got the five of wands okay and uh, some readers say that the five of wands is also um, disagreements or arguments but I don't really see the five of wands that way I think it is um, a card to remember and uh, us that there could be competition around 
uh, with friends or at work or in a study or in a competition itself and also being more playful and that we learn things in a playful way when we are competing with others and it keeps us on our toes and it will pay dividends this competition if you're entering competition or if you're competing with somebody because it's bringing in you the ten of pentacles money 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 you might need a loan to start up this business you will get it because you can prove you can beat the competition you might even get an inheritance this is also the card of happy families or that, that the family will be extended this could be with a dog or cat or any kind of pet or even a child Whoa, nice one reunion with family and friends perhaps somebody from your childhood might be coming back to visit you now Capricorn you also have the boat your ship is coming in your abundance is coming in now you've also got the ten of swords here the ten of um, I always forget the name of this uh, spades um, the ten of spades so there is an ending coming and there is a new beginning you might feel that you've been stabbed in the back by somebody in the past and they might be coming back to say sorry victory okay and again a ten uh, endings and a new beginning this is a ten and also an ending and a new beginning perhaps this friendship uh, from the past could be ending because you feel that you've been stabbed in the back and they're coming round to say sorry and victory will be yours but are you going to take them back as a friend can you trust them again you are quite creative because you've also got number three the boats mean that you might be traveling it could be on holiday or it could be moving home and the boat uh, could also mean not only abundance of money but could also be abundance of love you can you can get what you want like I said this is the energy of action and um, of fire and the fire signs go for what they want so perhaps you will take this person back after they have apologized if it is with regards to a friendship or a relationship could be love or could be business and the abundance can be love so you could be getting a lot of love especially from family and friends as you have the ten of pentacles you've got double numbers here so the angels have your back beautiful now we do have the warning here of the fox remember a fox sheds his fur but not his tricks and you've got the nine of clubs there not 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 clubs a clover so that's the nine of wands there's an ending to difficulties and a new beginning you've also got number 14 which is a five it will bring you out of balance something might this person might bring you out of balance because a fox does mean that they are analytical okay it could mean that they cross their T's and dot their I's um, before they make a decision and they can be sly they can also be um, quite mean because of a fox um, well the foxes aren't as bad as they are made out to be we have a picture um, in our mind that foxes are mean and sly but they're very clever and they do dot their I's and cross their T's and they want clarity so now it could be something it could be clear to you or to them that they were wrong and they are coming back to apologize okay and you, the victory will be yours but it will most probably be too late because you do not believe them you won't let yourself be uh, brought out of balance 
because that is, you've got the warning. So forewarned is forearmed. Or you can you can be the fox and um, say no. I'm very clever. I'm very sly. I've been analysing this and I've been thinking about it. No, I'm not going to take you back because I don't trust you because you stabbed me in the back before. Okay. So there is endings, endings, and beginnings, beginnings. This is an ending. This is an ending. This is an ending, and that could have been in the past the ending and you went into a new beginning and you could deal with the competition perhaps they were unfaithful to you because you had to compete to somebody if it is a relationship a love relationship they might have in been estranged and gone off with somebody else and now they want back in if it was at work then it could be that you um, have your own business or competition at work and somebody um, uh, kept an eye on you and you didn't know about that and they brought out news um, and that was like gossip. Now, you found the proof that you can handle competition and it was unfair competition and they weren't uh, to be trusted and so you got the evidence and you got clarity and you've got the celebration you've got victory wow it could have been with regards to money that somebody was lying okay or competing for a rise and they got the job but something became clear and you got your justice there could have been arguments and I think there could have been arguments about money as you've also got the um, king of wands here okay you've got the king of wands you're in balance definitely you're moving from a five to a six you are in balance you can stand your ground and um, the argument is short-lived because you've got the clarity you're not scared of the competition you know how to stand your ground you will speak your mind it could all um, um, it, like the king of wands uh, the clover because he's direct he's logical he's creative and he goes into action to find out what the truth exactly is so to avoid arguments because he does happen the clouds look that way and they are and it looks as if you've turned your back on arguments because you got the clarity so nobody can argue with you because you got the clarity you got the evidence like the king of wands it, or you could that you've taken the page out of the book of the king of wands but you could also be arguing with a king of wands and that's a tough cookie to crack because they go for what they want and they'll go for the jugular <laughs> to get what they want and they want clarity as well they they are good at business definitely but they could have been really sneaky because they wanted to win from the competition they know they can't because they know that you can stand your ground because you will do exactly the same get the right informa information or get professional help like an advocate or a lawyer wow and this is you are receiving news that you have succeeded that you're the winner no arguments about it now you've also got the child there is a new beginning more friends because you've got number 13 and number 13 means fellowship but one and three becomes a four so something new is going to be built on proper foundations and you do know what you want you've got the um, king of swords here the king of um, spades so you've got the clarity perhaps you went to a lawyer to get clarity or seek help or you could be meeting um, and uh, the king of spades is a Gemini but don't exclude Libra or Aquarium 
you could have met somebody new and it's very clear to you that you would like to continue with this okay there's a new beginning you might find out you're pregnant and the father could be a Gemini a Libra or an Aquarium but and the child not only means a birth of a child but also a birth of a new venture a project or a job it could be a job in the legal system or in a municipality or an institution like a school teacher um, you've all the ch child also means learn be more playful let your inner child come out learn things in a more in a both these cards are uh, also learning cards new courses new studies but also learning something in a playful way being the apprentice wow a nice one great messages here <coughs> excuse me so money will come to you or this could be a new job bringing you loads of money a well-paid job and you might get the news that you have been accepted instead of the competition somebody that was not trustworthy wow magic because you are steady and trustworthy and uh, you are lovable and honest you will fight well for what you believe in and get the truth out and you've learned from the past as well that is what you, that could mean as well so definitely abundance is coming your way the angel card that I've got for you is number 27 and that's a 9 so that means an ending again an ending and you will be in balance like I said you're moving from a, um, a 5 to a 6 amazing and here you are you've got the angel of inner peace and look at her she's opening her heart and a solar plex and she's receiving light from the angel the divine light to protect her and she's absolutely amazed look at her face so express full of expression you will have inner peace as well you are protected by the angels 1010 like I said abundance is on your on its way 47 is 11 again a sign from the angels they are with you blessings and thanks abundant universe that's the horn of abundance there you go so open yourself up to receive and be happy and safe I think it's a lovely reading again definitely uh, lots of positivity um, with the victory clarity new beginnings and endings so be ready for the new beginnings take care stay safe and be blessed and please share and like the videos take care love you all Thank you for watching the video I hope you enjoyed it and remember have a wonderful day and don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell on all and I'll see you in the life Monday Wednesday or Friday ciao ciao